Something special is happening in Belmont, and it's not only changing the way we eat out, but how we treat the people serving us. See for yourself. We try to be that happy place here in Belmont. And how could you not be happy when you run a store that looks like this? The Cotton Candy Factory is just one of three stores in the area with a mission that means as much to customers and the community as the products they sell. The factory, along with Cherub's Cafe next door and Spruced Goose Station in McAdenville, is run by Belmont's Holy Angels organization, a group that puts differently abled people to work. The job gives them a chance to grow through hard work. On the flip side, customers get a chance to better understand workers' disabilities, and the job doesn't come easy. And they do everything from sweeping the floors to wiping the tables to greeting customers to taking orders to helping in the kitchen to washing dishes. So they do it all. Regina Moody, president and CEO of Holy Angels, sat down with us to explain how the program works. Typically, workers rotate between jobs working part-time in either one of the three stores as they choose. They just seem to really enjoy life. It's kind of a fulfilled life and they like working, um, which is great to hear in today's world. And for those who get to work in the cotton candy factory, well, life is good. That's the happy place. It's kind of like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, but you can go in there and you can be overcome by the smell of sugar, but enjoy the fun of spinning your own cotton candy. That's where Mary Ellen comes in. She's a staple inside the factory, usually filling up bags of candy for customers, doing the job that she loves. What would you be doing if you didn't work here? I go crazy. <laughs> that pride must have been contagious because we saw the same look on Angie's face next door at Cherub's Cafe. I work in the kitchen. Okay. I work out here serving the customers and doing the order. And when we asked Angie what it felt like to get a paycheck every month, it was fun. I'm saving it to go to Disney World. In the end, it boils down to the kind okay, hearts okay, and the it. compassion displayed by these women and many others who saw the differently abled, well, differently. Well, you never know what abilities people have until you give them an opportunity. Taylor, do you like to work at the cotton candy factory? Yeah. We're real proud of you. You've learned lots of things here, haven't you? The Holy Angels organization is always looking to put more people to work. The group will work with someone's specific needs and find the shift that suits them best. All they ask is that their employees bring their heart to work.